All right, if there's, if there's more, f why are we back here? Why are we back there? There's gonna be one more fight, isn't there? Well done, Narukami. I'm sorry for the trouble we caused. No, we owe you too. Thank you for stopping the shadows. Wish I could have gone to the top myself, but I'll let you take the glory this time. I would have loved to fight Thank that you thing as you. Time. I'd love to afford that thing as Akihiko. go through a TV to get out of the TV? Come on, Blue Daruma, quit kidding around. It's for real. But, huh, now that you mention it, that is kind of weird, isn't it? Going into a TV leads you out of the TV? Jeez, what are you making it all complicated for? It's fine. The TVs are connected. These things only get confusing because you overthink them. <laughs> I like that. I like that. It's like, don't just don't think about it. Look. You just gotta show him. What the? Dude, what are you doing? Whoa, crap! tends to stay in motion. All right, I think that's the phrase. Shut up, it's your fault for rubbernecking. When I stuck my head out, I saw a security guard making the rounds. Huh? <laughs> Junpei, why are you sleeping on the floor? Just when we were trying to explain things to you. Hey, wait a sec. Kanji-kun, did you just say there was a guard out there? Huh? Yeah. So? Then the town's back to normal. The people who disappeared must be safe now, right? Oh, that's right! Good job, Junpei. You did great! Uh, I'm not sure what I had to do with it. <laughs> All right, it finally feels like we won! We saved the town our very own selves. We did it! Is it? Oh. Oh, hello. Show. What was that? Was that everyone turning around? What was that sound? Come at us however many times you want. But next time, we'll fight one on one. Fair and square. Which show was that though? Was that show or was that Mizun? Was that... Fuck. 
I almost said Mizunaki. That boy. So he survived. Yes. Regrettably, he is a serious criminal who tried to destroy the world. We cannot leave him be. I understand. But I won't be so stubborn this time. I ask that you all cooperate with us in capturing Minazuki. Okay, but here's my question. At the, start, at, the, at the very start, it was Igor and Margaret in the velvet room talking to someone who said, Oh, you won't need our help? Well, we'll see about that. And then Margaret said to you, Hey, you might make him a guest. Is he a guest now? Because he now understands bonds. Is is he is he now is he now wild card velvet room material? Is he? Yes, of course. Leave it to me. My persona's gotten real strong. I'll find that show in no time so Senpai can breathe easier. That reminds me. That dude was wearing our uniform. I guess we should start by beating the crap out of everyone at school? No violence yet, Kanji-kun. An investigation must be carried out based on thorough examination and confirmed evidence. Bitch, you have a sword slash in your back. Was he wearing our uniform? I didn't notice at all. I remember Minnie's smell too! <laughs> Minnie. He can run, but he can't hide from Teddy's nose! Minnie. Dude, will you stop giving everyone and everything those weird nicknames? Does your nose even work anymore? You've been sneezing this whole time. I haven't. That was because of the red fog. It was filled with a terrible curse and... Curses don't exist. Although given what Kagutsuchi was after, I suppose it did have an effect of that sort in truth. Uh, why are we so scatterbrained? Can't you guys stay on one topic for ten seconds? No, they cannot. Oh, sheesh. This brings more questions because of the P because of the P4G epilogue, which is set like five months after this. So like, yeah, are they still looking for show in the epilogue? Did they find him? Are they finding now? How, how does how does work? Because this is the end. This is the end of the uh, P4 continuity, basically. Uh, Dancing all night, I think is set. Because that's canon. I think Dancing All Night, Dancing All Night is set before this. I could be wrong. So, do we? I don't think there's a ending to the show saga. I think it's just up in the air after this. Sitting here makes it feel like I'm really back. <laughs> Indeed. It seems that for now, the case is closed. Man, that guy sure gave us some grief. Wasn't the world on the brink of ending? Mm-hmm. Although, I felt a bit sorry for him. Huh? For who? You can't even figure that out? She's talking about how Sho probably didn't want to turn out that way. Yeah. 
he's a really clumsy kid. <laughs> I keep thinking about how similar I was, you know? How? According to Mitsuru-san, ever since Ikutsuki abandoned Sho, he was left for dead in the hospital's care. I surmise that is where he learned of Ikutsuki's death, and later heard this plan's proposal from Minazuki. That reminds me! That thing that showed up at the end! Hino Kagutsuchi, right? What was that thing, really? I have no idea. Yeah. It said it was born when this town was enshrouded in fog. Hmm. And that's not all. It was all over my fuzzy head, but what was that collective will of so-and-so part about? Erebus and whatnot. I guess it was formed from the hearts of people who only think about themselves, never caring what happens to others. Basically a selfish Erebus. Erebus is humans wanting for destruction, and Kagasuchi was humans just wishing for isolation. God, human consciousness is awful and dangerous! Yeah, when the fog covered this town last time, the hearts of people who only cared about their own safety gathered and formed that Hino Kagutsuchi. That's a sad way to be. I wonder why some people think like that. Because it's easier. Well, there's nothing we can do about it except to do our best. By the way, partner. Yeah. Where, where's Adachi? See Adachi up there? There we go. What happened to him in the end? No way! Adachi-san? That bastard was here? Oh yeah, you weren't part of that, were you? That was a hype screen, though. I don't care. Don't worry about him. He'll obey the rules. I mean, I'd ask questions. I'd ask many questions. All right then, let's go home. But man, some long holiday this turned out to be. Seriously, you couldn't came to visit and we didn't get to talk at all. <laughs> oh well. But now that it's all over, I think I had fun. Ah! Yuki-chan, have you turned to violence? Mm. Thinking back on it, I did see some dangerously scary faces from you. Teddy, would you like to see me angry? Ah! There! That's exactly what I'm talking about! I somewhat understand what Yukiko-senpai means. Despite the lost time, we've gathered as a group again. I'm glad for that much. Dildo, what does the what does the Dachi do? Did he just, did he just go off on his own now? Is he a fugitive? Hey, senpai, I'm hungry. Can we go grab a bite yet? <laughs> Scale treat, of course. You can fuck off. I'm not treating anyone. The store's not even open. Stop trying to make me treat you guys every time. Yeah, but it's like, what's the thought? Is it that she's gonna get go off on his own, just live? He's gonna get a part-time job. It's gonna be on the run forever. What is? What is? What does who does do? How do? What do? Marie. What about Marie though? She good? Questions. Let's go, everyone. Oh, yeah, boy, epilogue. Epilogue, actually, and the fact that I'm at eighty five per cent. What the fuck have I missed? What have I missed? I'm at 85%. I guess that one that one branch and path I had, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Hey, bae. 
thanks for your hard work. Yeah, same to you. It's not like I really did anything. It was getting my butt handed to me and you weren't around. Like, that was fun. You were keeping Dojima-san and everyone else safe, weren't you? That was a huge help. Stupid, stupid no tech love machine. You're being too honest with me. Stupid. Love this. I, I, I don't know why, but part of me loves the fact. It's like with Risa, I love the fact that even if you don't romance them, it's very clear they have a thing for you. I love it. Also, can we talk about can we talk about how this motherfucker here, Margaret, who is like on par or maybe better than a god, Marie, who is in her current form a minor god. This guy has gods on his dick. What the fuck? Hey, this town. Um, do you like it? Huh? Yeah, I love it. G go home already. Get out of here and. Do you do you do you not do you not get it you? Because she is the town. If you love the town, you live. Do do you not do you not get what she was asking? Come on, you have to get that you. Come on, come on, come on. Bro, pl player the player, brother the brother. Come on, you you must have known what she said there. I'm just, just just saying. Come on, come on. You have you have to know, man. Come on. You're not an idiot. You're not an idiot. You come on. You know you know what she said. Thanks for bringing my things all the way here. Don't worry about it. Man, you seem pretty busy. So, if you're headed back, does that mean things are settled? Again, I love this too. I love how he just knows. He's just like, okay, so... I don't know what you did. But I assume it's good now? <laughs> We're safe, right? Take some more time off the next time you come. She seemed pretty lonely. <laughs> oh, Yukon, it's almost time! Well then, time to disband the investigation team for real this time. I feel a little down when you actually come out and say it like that. Yes. But disbanding means that the case has been solved. We should take pride in that, at least. Investigation team? Oh, crap! Uh, um, Chihei's dog went missing, so... Huh? Really? Oh, yeah! If you had told me, I would have rushed to help in a jiffy! Oh, yeah, did, did they get the dog back? Why are you falling for that? Just stay quiet! That's not fair! I wanted to help, too! I'm sorry, Nanako. I'll be back in the summer. Really? Yeah, and that's Whoa, for reals? Yeah, and that's that's the P4 epilogue when you have black hair and glasses. What the fuck? Can we talk you look like an upstanding Asian man? I don't mean to I don't that that might sound racist, I'm not sure, but like you know you know like the 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 normal like trope you get in anime. Where it's just normal guy, buttoned up shirt, glasses, black hair because Asian. That, that's you! How and why? You're gonna stay the whole summer, right? Oh, uh... Yay! That's more than a month! We can do anything then! Let's see, the summer festival? Going swimming in the ocean? Ooh, and the fireworks show! We wouldn't mind at all. Nanako would love to have you around. Yay! The train will be arriving shortly. 
please step behind the white lines for your safety. I'll play with you. I know. Nanako-chan, come over to my place. We have a dog. No, I want Big Fro. Nanako, if you keep saying such selfish things, I'll tell you a scary story before bed. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Day parented summer vacation on ago. We can play more then. Okay. Great A parenting. Well, Nanako chan doesn't like scary stories. Yeah. If she sees a scary story on TV before bed, she can't go to the bathroom by herself. I'm the one who gets woken up in the middle of the night. Dad! <laughs> sorry, sorry. Jeez, we're through, Dad. <laughs> Oh. Okay. Um. God damn it, Nanako. Bloody children. Nothing but trouble. Nothing but trouble. Break. Broke. Broken? Uh, eat. Uh, eaten? What are you doing? Why the hell does it keep changing like that? Break? What is it, a car? I don't even have any brothers named Ken! What? Oh my! Are you studying English? <laughs> it must be a cold day in hell. Oh wow. You, you old hag! I'm trying to study here so- Also, oh, is that Aegis' voice actress? My, my. He's embarrassed. <laughs> That's someone's voice actress! I think I've asked this. I think someone's answered in the comments before. I don't remember! But I think this has been brought up before and I think that's Aegis! Also, I want to point out a little tidbit that I've, that I've learnt. There's three, there's three party members in P4 that dye their hair. There's, there's this boy here. Chie and Yosuke also dye their hair. Why? Why is dyeing your hair such a big thing? It's because not everyone wants to be black, want to be black haired. What about you? You got that silver hair. That ain't natural. Oh, that's right. There's something I wanted to ask you. Yeah, that's I just. Well, what is it? Quit bothering me. I, I just hurry up and ask already. Well, our dyes seem to be running out much faster lately. Do you know anything about that? There you go. Dyes, boy. Your hair dye. Uh, how, how should I know? Maybe we had a, a burglar or something. Oh, my. <laughs> a burglar who only steals dyes. Like I said, how should I know? You're probably just imagining it anyway. Is that so? How odd. Oh, are you using the dice for work? Yeah, he's using dice for work. Okay. Oh, I just remembered. That navy blue handkerchief I washed yesterday had an odd unevenness to its coloring. What? Like how? Well, that handkerchief was my best work lately and... Wait, 
The one I washed was a white handkerchief. Oh, the ravages of age. I keep misremembering things. <laughs> Brilliant. You old hag! Brilliant. I love the relationship between Kanji and his mum. Like he's a punk. He's a punk even to her, but she handles him so perfectly. The color just isn't the same. That's an oddly noble of you. I ain't giving up, god damn it. Okay, Kanji. Okay, Kanji, we love you. You're perfect. Your best boy. You're precious, I must be protected. Excuse me. I guess this is like the final send off. It's like, okay, guys, guys, we promise. P4 is done. Say goodbye to the characters, guys. We're done. Oh, you're a high school girl and a manager? That's awesome. Hey, could you wash my back later? Sir, please don't joke like that. Well, I might consider it if you held a party here every day for the next year. Really? I'll take you up on that. <laughs> Thank you for your patronage. Of course, I must ask that you pay for everything up front. <laughs> huh? Okay, that's genius. Yuki-chan, are you okay? Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? Don't worry. I'll make sure to lean on you and the others if I'm ever feeling stressed. Please help me out if that happens. Really? missing a bit of tartness. Maybe I should use yogurt. Huh? It burned? That's odd. I was sure this was how the chefs did it. You I don't know what you're cooking, but never add yogurt. I smell something burning. Are you okay? I'm okay. For now. You're improving as a manager. But I think your progress as a cook is still bumpy. Questions first. All right, police girl, what you got?
What is this? Some kind of old manuscript? Oh, I'm in great shape at least. How come there aren't any practical skills in the primary exam? I bet Master would totally ace the written exams, too. I mean, he'd make it to the top easy. Okay, I want, I want to get to the epilogue for the P3 story, and it's him not understanding anything. Like, he's terrible at school, and we just never knew. Like, he's... He's actually dumber than Chie. I want that to be a f like 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 Junpei has to tutor him. Can you imagine that? We get the parallel of this scene and he's worse than her. I want to get the parallel of this scene. I want to get Akihiko's epilogue just to see. This idiot. I can't say my. I, I can't hate her too much. Like there are parts of her I really hate and really dislike, but she's also lovable in her own way. I gotta admit. I don't think I've seen that outfit before. What is that? What are you wearing? What do you mean? You probably believe that this investigation is about the potential dangers of the Kirijo group. But that's not the truth. It was ordered by top public safety officials who aren't keen on Mitsuru Kirijo's influence. They're trying to find fault with her to rein her in. 
Then, were these top officials dissatisfied with my report? Oh, your report was detailed and accurate. But that was too fair for their liking. Are you asking me to report a distortion of the truth? <laughs> Don't glare like that. The officials used Kirijo's disappearance this time to order an investigation on the Shadow Operative's facility. Yes, I know about that. I'd heard from my friends. But these investigation results aren't what those at the top hoped for. If this continues, they may abandon rational judgment in their desperation. In other words, you think they would begin to suspect me as taking sides with Kirijo? Yes, but that's not what we hope to see happen. In all honesty, enabling their power struggle has no upside for our organization at all. <sighs> we are very satisfied with your work. That's why it would be less than ideal if you lost favor with the top officials and became unhirable. I understand. Though they're all part of public safety, you're saying the top officials and the on-site investigators have different views. <laughs> That's the nature of the beast. You have my permission to continue visiting this place from now on. So, I ask that you play along this once. Permission to continue? So, you leave a thread for me to follow while telling me not to get too involved. A bit self-serving, wouldn't you say? A harsh assessment. Both the inner truth and the outer veneer matter in society. That's how it is. I was only joking. I thank you for your generous consideration. bears further investigation. I'm just wondering if that watch is the uh, gadget watch she made. I can imagine it is. Seriously, what's his outfit? I like it. I like it. It seems I'm about to be very busy. All right, that must be the place. Reset? Oh, no. Thanks to this case, I feel like I'm finally prepared to face my future. It's like I finally made a breakthrough. A breakthrough? I can understand that. I kept wondering if there was any way I could spend my time with everyone forever and ever. Mm -hmm. But I realized that that's just running from reality. Seriously, people, people don't like Yosuke with a passion. Like people hate Yosuke as much as I dislike Chie a lot of the time. But you can't tell me that he hasn't gone through the most like development throughout the entire P4 arc. 
Like, yeah, the, the joke is he is basically Junpei. He's basically a discount Junpei. But like Junpei, he's gone through the most development throughout his entire game. And in this, in this case, m multiple games. But it's like, my boy is now a man. My boy is now a man. That's why for now, I'm focused on finding a big project that won't bore me until I die. First, I'm going to go to college and expand my horizons. I guess for how long I thought about it, it's a pretty standard path. No, I think that's just like you, Yosuke. Isn't the long consideration really the important part? I have no idea which ones are any good. Huh? What are you doing, Yosuke? The shelf with the nurses is over there. I'll stay over here for today, thanks. Huh? Oh, you're looking for camouflage. Something to hide your nurses with? What the hell no! Alright, how strong do you have to be to pick up that guy like that? Or how light is Teddy, just in general? Also, I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna stop this progression right here. Never, never mind, you're about to shut me up. You're about to shut me up. Okay, I was gonna ask. I was gonna, I was gonna say, I'm gonna stop it right here. So I can ask the question of when everyone moves forward with their lives like they plan to, what would Teddy do? Will Teddy stay at Juness? Will he continue to live at the, at the, um, wait, wait, at, fucking, I've forgotten y Yosuke's surname. Hanamura. Will he continue to live at the Hanamura household or will he go back to the TV world? But I think we're going to get the answer right here. Does he age? I think I've asked this before, but does he age? to be a section for elegant summer clothes for the early season. So why set up a swimsuit sale, huh? Stop changing things on your own. Oh, but Sensei will come back once summer comes, right? My mind is already in full summer mode! You're jumping the gun way too much. Don't drag our store into your shenanigans. You say that, but aren't you curious too? Don't you want Yuki-chan, Chie-chan, Rise-chan, and Nao-chan to wear these new swimsuits as soon as possible? Naoto is the only person in this entire game. In this, in, in all of P... No, no, Marie is where I want to go, if you want to count that. Marie and Naoto, the only two characters that you don't see in some sort of beach attire. Well, sure. But wait, we were talking about me. Oh, I know. When Sensei comes back, let's invite Michan and her friends to the beach! Mitsuru-san and her friends, huh? Oh, they're regular working folks. I mean, they're a special unit, so I don't think they could just... Yosuke! The game will end if you give up! Just imagine what they'd all look like in swimsuits! <laughs> Why does Naoto get- <laughs> Why does- 
I like how they all get like proper bikinis and stuff and Naruto's just in the back there with a one piece like okay okay I ain't showing nothing I ain't showing nothing to you guys <laughs> okay Change the fact that it's way too early for this. Hurry up and get the display how it's supposed to. Also, how does he know? How does he know what Mitsuru, Yukari, and Fuka have as? Because that is, that there is what they wore in P3. How do you know what they have? How do you know what they wore two years ago? No, I will staunchly protect my paradise. Your weird paradise has no place in our store. If you don't hurry and fix this, I'm docking your pay. This is tyranny! Utter totalitarianism! And we got no answers to what Teddy's gonna do when everyone moves on, but okay. Well then, let's start from Act 3. Ready? Go! Look! A white bird! Could it be the same one we saw together last summer? Who cares about birds right now? If there's something you want to say, then say it. Please don't be that way. I trusted in you. I believed in our promise that we'd come here on this day. So why... Why did you bring her? I feel like an utter fool. What do you say, John? No, Isan, we're still rehearsing here. Oh! Sorry, please forgive me. Kuchikawa, it's time. You're free to go. Everyone else, take it from the top of that scene. Huh? But... Go on or they'll yell at me. The promise was we'd do this without getting in the way of your other work. Though, I mean, your acting was great. Thank you. Um... Is there anything else? What do you mean, anything else? Um, anything I should work on? I just told you that your acting was great. You're rushing this too much. Well, I don't know. I guess you need to work on accepting your strengths and trying to build on them. Sure. Accept my strengths? That's right. Hey, I take back what I said. Everyone take a 30-minute breather. about in Oe-san. Oh, right. The response to your TV appearance the other day was amazing. We keep getting tons of calls with more work for you. And that's why we'd really like to set up an actual schedule and put a huge media blitz behind your comeback. No, I told you that's not what I want. I'm not even close to my peak performance yet. Huh? But, but they're all really good deals, you know? Nope. Don't you remember how we talked this over with the agency? I want to put my schoolwork first right now. Oh, can you bring the car to the front? Huh? Risei John, where are we? I have voice training after this. Come on, you're my manager. Get your act together. Oh, right. Sorry. Can you give me a ride? I want to hear about what kind of work came in. Of course. I'll bring the car around, so wait at the entrance. I want to point out, she's she's like 16 now. This girl has put... This girl has more drive in her life than I do. She has more drive in her life, more control in her life than like 95% of the people I know. This bitch! Jesus! This girl is going places! And not just because she's already fucking famous, but just Jesus!
And there we go. There we go. The team moving on with their futures, striving to be better people. Oh, good. Oh, good shit. Ah, oh, that was that was so so much more enjoyable than P4A. My God. And I wanted to say one one last thing on those little those epilogues. I do I do like that. I do like how when games when games and game series are like okay, this is the last hurrah for these characters. We're gonna show them moving on with their lives now. This is this is your final goodbye for each one of these characters individually. I like that. Then again, I'm not sure if I'm not sure if um Q and Dark Souls Night came out after this, so. It might undermine the meaning behind those, but still, I like that. I like it when you're when you're with characters for a long time, and then the game goes, "Okay, this is it for them. This is them moving forward on their own. They're finally willing to say goodbye to what's happened. They're being their own people now. I like that. I like that shit." Oh, after this, we got the P3 team to do, and then we're done. Ah, the epilogue for the P4. This, despite me being with the P4 team for longer, I'm gonna feel, I'm gonna feel the feels if when I get the epilogue for the P3 team, because that's it. Because they're gonna be gone. They're gonna be gone. They're gonna be done forever. But we'll see when we get there. We'll see when we get there. This program was brought to you by the following sponsors.
Motherfucker, you what now? That's all well and good. I like I like how it's in the elevator. I'm okay with this, but but motherfucker, you what now? Motherfucker, you what now? <laughs> <laughs>